Yo, this is Sano Place, Pokemon Soul Silver. We are in Vermilion City, we have reached the Kanto region, and it's time for us to get eight more badges. The first one already in this episode. But one thing I don't know will change to my party, not really level wise, but I don't know change to hit my chan. I got rid of his strength in Blackthorn City and I replace it with Earthquake. Yeah, I used TM26 Earthquake on Hitmonchan, and the reason why is because Electric Pokemon, which is the gym in Vermilion City is consisting of, they have only one weakness. That is the ground type. Ground is what kills off the Electric Pokemon. Yeah, no other weakness. They have some resistance such as uh, Electric, Steel and Flying. I don't even have Cut. Uh. I hate these things. Oh well, well, I guess we have to get rid of some move them for cut. What can we take them? You know what? I'm not gonna do that. It's a bit of a lame thing having to use these simpler moves like cut, for example, to get through it. But you have to do that in the in generation three or generation one, should we say? So I'm just gonna do it differently. I'm just gonna go get myself one of my Pokemon I captured earlier and give that one cut, so I can cut through it and just have five Pokemon in our team. Which one of these can use cut? Surely a hop it can. With B drill as well. Yeah, let's give it the B drill. Okay, so I won't be able to use for alligator much here, so I'm just gonna skip for alligator and actually dump him for this episode. I'm also dump uh, Lugia, but Lugia's more tanky, so he can survive and deal damage. Even though his um, his uh, flying types don't really do a lot of damage to uh, electric types because. Uh, Electric types are resistant to flying. Oh well, at least we got Beardrill. He can be our cut bitch. So let's give him cut. So we can go through and fight in the gym. Beardrill, you don't need focus energy in my opinion. Let's give it a focus energy. And learn cut. There we go. Now, Hitmonchan will be the one I'll be using most here, so I might as well just switch out my Pokémon. Because Ampharos does fine damage, but he doesn't really have a lot of moves that can do a lot of damage in return to those Pokémon. Even though he's resistant to electric types, but... Eh, we'll see. I also can also use Pokémon like... Uh, well, it's actually one only Ampharos who's resistant here. Lugia's weak, and the rest are fine. Scissors metal moves don't really do a lot of damage to it because the electric types are resistant to steel. Flareon and Hitmonchan will do fine, so let's just start our ways with Hitmonchan. Let's cut the tree with B Drill. There we go. And we can enter Vermilion City Gym. Yo, Legend in the Making, you locked out this time. The traps at this gym have been out in order for a while, but the traps are back up and running now. Why lucky, you may ask? Because you can train yourself better that way. Make up your mind and go for Lieutenant Search. So we have three trainers here and we have two locks. Now what in order to get to Lieutenant Search, we have to open and find two open, like, unlock things in trash bits. Once you find one, you have to find the other right away. If you don't, well, then you're gonna be stuck. Now here's a, here's a clue. The second lock is right next to the other lock. I'm gonna take you down, prepare to be shocked. Near the music is changing. It's similar to the counter music, Juggler Horton. With Electrode. My hit more chance. Now, Electrode will be faster than me, but I will give him an earthquake. Swift from Electrode. Land your quick. Shake, rattle, and roll. That's gonna be super effective. Electrode will not survive that. He's weak to ground. It's gonna KO Electrode right away. Next up will be Electrode number two. Well, we can settle with that. Let's get in. Electrode number two with another Earthquake. Swift, no damage move, which can never miss. And then land an earthquake again. I think this electrode will survive that, which I don't really think he will. 
go. Earthquake lands, and a jolt faints. That's just the end of that story. Next up will be Electro number three. This guy only has electrodes? Cool. Easy piece for us, even though we might have to go back to the Pokemon Center and heal up between these moves. For the Shockwave. Shockwave is a uh, similar to Swift. It's never missing. So you can la launch out your uh, Shockwave. And regardless if you have a lot of double teams or reduce the curse from Sun Attack, Shockwave will always land. It much as Earthquake lands, Electro. And that's gonna be a KO again! Well done, Hitmonchan! Almost a level up for that. Yeah, I was so overpowered! No, don't fret about it. Nothing in here but trash, nothing here but trash. No. 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 I think it's which. No. Which one is it? Let's see, I think it's this one. No. Nope. Lock it again. Now they will reset again, so I have to go look for it again. There's a switch. Let's see, is it this one maybe? Yeah, that's it! Now the defense is gone, and we can go fight the Lieutenant Surge right away. Should we though? Now let's get some experience. You're here to defeat Lieutenant Surge? But if I can help it... Oh, is that so? You made up with Gentleman Gregory with three Pokémon. Where's the Pikachu? Everyone's favorite mascot Pokémon is about to be demolished if I can survive though, because it would have a bit low health. Pikachu with Light Screen to reduce the special attack from our attacks. That's not gonna help, because... Earthquake is a physical hit. So Light Screen will do nothing against the Earthquake. The Pikachu is a bit frail, so it's gonna go down in a single hit. Hitmonchan gets 107 XP, and that's gonna be level 49 for Hitmonchan. Next up will be Electrike. Ooh, that's a new one. Electrike is an electric Pokemon from Generation 3. We can stick with Hitmonchan for this. Interesting little Pokemon. Need to heal up a bit so I'll use Drain Punch instead. Do heavy physical damage and I will restore about half the damage I do in health. Wanted KO as well. Look at that. So that's over 50 health restored right there. About 30 health restored right there. Was it 40? Nah. Details. Flat Fizz next. Let's keep on hit one chance for this. Versus Flaffy. I don't think I'll do Earthquake again, because my health level is fine. And Earthquake lands on the Flaffy. That's gonna do so much damage, and Flaffy will not be able to survive that. And Flaffy will go down. Let's restore our XP up, and we beat Gentleman Gregory. Sorry I failed, Lieutenant Surge, sir. Nah, uh, don't fret about it. With those in the way? Oh, Parry is calling. <laughs> Sup? This is Parry, how are ya? You? you thinking you'd like to battle me? Am I right or what? Yep, we'll meet at Route 45. Route 45 it is. We'll get there sometime, I guess. But we cannot have time for a battle like this. I mean, we have the whole counter region to explore. I mean, come on. So many badges, so many adventures. And this is the first one. Getting one more badge, getting badge number nine. That's so weird, because only been generation two that had this kind of glory where we can get over eight badges. I like that. It doesn't count generation seven's uh, totem Pokemon though, but oh well. It's not the same. Still cool though. Alright, let's go down again, and let's face off against Lieutenant Surge. Oh yeah. Now, Lieutenant Surge has increased the amount of Pokémon from last time, and all of his electric types, so it's important that you are ready for it also. Has a Paralyze Seals ready because my electric types like to paralyze Pokémon, and that's gonna be bad. Oh, I forgot. Damn it. Next to the gym, the locks are reset. That's fine though. We defeated two trainers. Oh, there's a switch. Where's number switch number two? This one. Yes! That was lucky of me! 
There we go. Talent Surge can be fought once again. Let's go up to talk to him and let's go on with the first of eight counter badges and the ninth badge gym in total. Let's go with the Lightning American with Talent Surge. Hey, you little tyke. It may not be very smart to challenge me, but it takes guts. When it comes to electric type, I'm number one. I never lost on the battlefield. I'll zap you just like I do all my enemies in battle. And here we go with Lieutenant Surge. We beat him, we get the amazing Thunder Badge. Yes, five Pokemon this time. It's gonna be tough. The music is also changed here to show off the greatness of Generation 1 gym battle music. And the first Pokemon will be right with the level 51. Let's go with Earthquake. It's going to be bad because Raichu is going to answer with double team to increase his evasion. Will I still be able to strike Earthquake? No, it's going to miss. Unlucky. Try again. But if Raichu says, oh, you're going to try again? Oh, you're just going to increase your evasion again. Reducing your chance with Earthquakes. But it still has a chance to hit and I just land it. Will it survive Raichu? Or is this going to be a KO? The health goes down. No, Raichu survives. Barely. Then search will use full restore on Raichu to get it back to health again. But what if my earthquake lands? No, it's missed again. Damn it. Two misses, one hit. Double team number three from Raichu. Which means my evasion is going to be more of a nightmare. But I do hit it. I do hit it. And Raichu is going to get damaged again. What now, Raichu? What now? Still in the red level. Let's end the job with an ice punch. Shockwave from Raichu. Shocking it up, landing. Never miss. Power is gonna be strong against Hitmochan. Ice punch miss. Try it again. Shockwave number two from Raichu. It's gonna be a tough battle. Lands. Hitmochan survives. Ice punch misses again. Try it a third time. Shockwave will land again. If this next ice punch miss, I'm afraid this is gonna be it for Hitmonchan. It missed again. Damn it. Three misses in a row. I have no other choice. Hyper Potion, go. I mean, this guy is full restore. I'll do the same. I don't need to use full restore. Hyper Potion is more enough to restore the health of Hitmonchan. Raichu is going to do a quick attack, thinks that was going to KO me. That won't help him. Let's try this punch again. Shockwave, again lands on me, nothing you can do about it, it will never miss. I really wish I had a shockwave. Oh well, that's fine. Ice punch missed again, fourth miss in a row. Another shockwave coming. A bit boring to watch, excuse me. She's shockwaving me and I'm missing my ice punches. And repeat. Five minutes in a row, and we're back in the dangerous level. We'll do this again. I cannot believe it. We have no other choice. The double team is so annoying. Potion lands. Right here, we use another shockwave. He doesn't bite that one. He will think that I'm not gonna survive the shockwave, so we use the shockwave again. Another ice punch. And. I hope he goes out of PP soon because this shockwave spam is annoying. I think it's better than having more double teams though. Ah, the ice burn lands! Finally! Six hits it took. I get paralyzed though, which is a bit lame, but that's fine. I have full restores, so I can use that myself. Where she goes down, and this means we have four more Pokemon to battle. Next will be Electrode. Ugh, annoying, but nothing much you can do about it. For this one, I'll send in Amphrox. I need to restore my glorified uh, Hitmonchan to glory first before I send him out again. I'll throw it in level 47. Let's start right away by using a full restore on Hitmonchan, get him back to health and restore the paralyzer status. He's ready to fight again soon. And he's gonna do the very same annoying things. Ah, uh, damn it. Not much we can do about it though, sadly. We'll do a discharge. 
think this will do more damage, even though it's resistant for Electrode compared to Signal Beam. And the problem is that now he's been using yeah, Double Team twice. How so much damage we do? Nah, not that much. Just Signal Beam, let's see that's better. That's green from Electrode, which means his special damage will be going down by one third. Signal Beam. Not much. So Beam is a special attack, that's probably why. I could like to try, but he's probably has a static thing, so I'll probably get paralyzed. Let's try this charge again. For Shockwave 2. Shockwave is so annoying. Damn it. Discharge, miss. Shockwave lands again. Which way might even be better to just actually switch and hit one chat, but uh, I'm gonna keep on trying. Yeah, I'm just gonna do it. It's gonna be a long ass battle. I'm gonna double team so many paralyzing effects. This battle is just all about stalling. Shockwave's gonna land on me this again, but Electro doesn't have a lot of special attack compared to um, Raichu, so it's gonna do, gonna do less damage. Now let's go with Earthquake. Electro is uh, happy enough about his uh, double team, so we're gonna do it again. Question though, will my Earthquake land or will it miss? It's gonna land! Is this enough though to KO Electrode? It should be! Electrode is weaker defensively than Raichu, and there's less health, and he's gonna go down! Well done, hit one chan! Halfway through, two Pokemon down, three more to go! Next up will be... Electabuzz! Ooh, nasty! Electabuzz, pure electric type. So it's gonna be interesting, I'll actually go Drain Punch this first because I need to restore some health. Like the bus with low kick on hit one chan. I'm in a danger level, here comes the Drain Punch. Half the damage I do it will be restored. That's fine. Let's go with Earthquake next. Light screen from Like the Bus. But will Like the Bus survive the Earthquake though? I don't think so. That's the key here. You don't want to activate the healing from Lieutenant Search, but you get him low first, and then we use a powerful move to get him KO'd. And Electabuzz goes down. Two more Pokémon to fight before this Thunder Badge is ours. Electrode again? That's fine. Let's go with Electrode number two. We start off with Earthquake again. Charge Beam from Electrode on to Hitmochan. Doing a bit of damage, but special attack is gonna increase. But it doesn't have any double team this time, so Electrode's gonna face the wrath of the earthquake. Question is, will this be enough? I think it will be, but will it? It will. One hit KO on Electrode. Well done, hit Monchan. And hit Monchan is level 50. Next Pokemon will be Magneton. Ooh boy. Close switch to Hitmachan, but I'm a bit scared here because Hitmachan can for inst KO Mag Magnet. Actually, yeah, I'm just actually keep it. The thing is that Magneton might be fast and KO me first, but I'm just gonna make it safe. It's not over yet, it's just beginning. I don't think so. So I'm gonna use another Hyper Potion on Hitmachan to make sure he's gonna be fully healed. And I have two ways to do this I can either do Drain Punch, which is super effective. Or Earthquake, which is quad effective. Manton has four time weakness to ground moves. Mirror shot. I'm gonna do some normal damage there. It's gonna kill me though if I didn't use the potion. Earthquake. Lance. Will Manton survive a quadruple weakness to Earthquake? Let's see. The answer is no! Magneton goes down! And that means it's time to surge has been defeated, and we have secured another badge. Malectic Trick! Ugh, you're too strong. Okay, kid, you get the Thunder Badge. We get a Thunder Badge from Lieutenant Surge, and our badge collection goes to 9, the first one from the Counter Region. Lieutenant Badge, Thunder Badge, shoots those who defeated me. Take good care of it, okay? There's something else. Here's a great TM for you. We get TM 34.
Oh, well, shockwave, I guess. That TM contains shockwave. Sap. Use it to go like lightning. When you go north, you will see a big city called Saffron. Hey, kids, still slugging and chugging away. When you go north, you will see a big city called Saffron. That's right, and this time Saffron City is open in the very beginning. We're gonna go there and get ourselves some cool new stuff. That will be the next episode though. Next episode we're gonna head north to Saffron City and see what awaits us there. Like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, Twitch and Facebook. And that's commit for now, so I'll see you guys next time as my story of Pokemon Soul Silver continues.